Hi, this is Jonathan Gardner. Uh, section 711, the example one is, is rather simple. So he has a um, some kind of you know material with some weird cross section. It, at least it's consistent if I can duplicate what I just did there. And we are going to place this between uh, two charged plates. Um, well, let's just pretend that over here we have a potential of V naught, and over here we have a potential of zero. Okay, and the question is, how does the current that flows through this material relate to the conductivity of the material and the potential? So, it's rather easy to solve. Um, uh, we're actually going to go more in depth in example three of why the electric field is constant in here, and it has to do everything with that you learned in, in chapter three about solving for Laplace's equation. Um, but regardless, uh, we have a constant electric field pointing from the hot plate to the cold plate. Well, not cold plate, ground plate. Um, so the current is going to be the current density times the area. So I is going to be the current density times the area, the cross-sectional area. And that's going to be equal to sigma times electric field. This is Ohm's law. So we get sig sigma times electric field times the cross-sectional area. And the electric field is just going to be the potential difference between the two plates divided by the length. So we get V over L times the area. Okay, And so we get this nice little relation that the current is equal to sigma A over L times the potential difference between the two. That was easy. Let's do example two next. Thanks for your time.